Good beautiful morning everybody and welcome to the vlog. I don't know if I say this week's vlog because they've been lasting longer than a week. So I've got Rosemary with me. There she is. Beautiful Rosemary. She's actually getting bigger. She's uh, pregnant. Um, I got Hershey who likes to sleep in the center console. Hershey's nose got bit or a scratch attacked by another dog basically. Uh, Ruby. Ruby. Ruby, there's Ruby. Um, Ruby, Ruby, really? But Rosemary's pregnant. I'm not sure how many puppies or she has, but I've also bought two new puppies. I've got a video that I'll insert right here of the puppies, but we're on our way to the shop. We've got some painting to do, so let's get started. And I need to remember to do endings to the videos because I've been having a bad habit of not doing endings. Yeah, so that happened. So, good morning everybody. We are actually heading to the beach tomorrow. We'll figure out how early. My mother-in-law is wanting to leave at 6 a.m. Chris is probably gonna wanna leave later than that, so we'll figure out which time, what time we're gonna go. So, but we're taking all the dogs, all eight. Obviously mine, there's two. Zero, Ruby, Rosemary, Hershey, Fuzzy. We're not taking the two new ones, Axel and Maya, not just yet. But we're taking, then we're taking my mother-in-law's dogs, Coco, Gabby, and Chance. All mine are little, all her, but Chance is little. Chance is an Aussie, but I'll, I'll stick to my little dogs. I think I like my little dogs more. They're easier to control. Chance is, he's a good dog. He is a great dog, but he is so much energy and so hard to control. All right. I'm trying to figure out how the muzzle thing works. Zero is a... Not big on the muzzle, so I'm gonna see if I get that to work. Cause he never stops bark, stops barking. But anyways, uh, I had some errands to run. I've been running errands all day to get ready for tomorrow. But we're gonna stay tomorrow night. It's tomorrow, tomorrow night, and uh, leave Monday morning. Sometime Monday, not not for sure in the morning. But uh, yeah, we're gonna go to Galveston. This is the first time my mother-in-law's been in over five years. So we uh paid for the entire trip she deserves to go so we're going to Galveston let's have some fun Ruby's been Rosemary's been when she was a puppy with Dot but the other uh, other three have not been so we'll see how this goes good beautiful morning everybody when is today Sunday Sunday happy Sunday everybody it's a uh, animal kingdom comes on today so we're headed to the beach today. Me, Chris, our family, or his family, our family, and all the dogs. Here's Hershey. And there's Mr. Chance back there. And the rest of them, but you cannot see them. They're actually laying down trying to go back to sleep. <laughs> Aside from Chance, he's excited. The dog is, how old is Chance? Three. He is three? Yep. He's three years old, never been on vacation. Hershey, you're stuck. Never been out of the house. <laughs> True, never been out of the house aside from to go to the vet. Um, ours have been out of the house. Ruby and Rosemary went to the vet right before Dot passed away. But it's been a while since Chris's mom, my mother-in-law, went to the beach. Uh, over five years? Probably more than that. Probably more than five years. What are you doing? Hershey wants to get in the back seat, but she's not going to the back seat. You're too tiny. Yeah, you're too small. I love you. But we've been waiting for this trip. Okay, Ru I mean Hershey. Ruby. Ruby's excited too. We're gonna go crab hunting and they're gonna go fishing and <laughs> Hershey said we're gonna take lots of naps. But I'll do plenty of uh, fun little snapshots while we're down there. Hershey. <laughs> Gotta be careful with Hershey's nose. She got her nose uh, scratched off or bit off one of the two and it still hasn't healed. We're on, I think, day seven of her nose being like that. Huh? Yeah. It's looking better, but poor Hershey and her poor nose. But let's get a move on. We've got like two hours to go. We're about 40 minutes away, and we started smelling something so awful. And you think with like, how many dogs? Six dogs in the car. Some have pooped in the car. Rosemary's having pregnancy parts. I'm feeling so bad for because it was so bad. 
Uh, lame chance. I mean, he's back. He's a big Aussie laying back in the very back. There he is. There he is. So we figured, okay, it's just fucking, it's just chance. Um, and it was one behind me, and I think it's Rosemary doing panic pregnancy parts. Oh my gosh. Rosemary might be crying. I can't tell if her eyes are all watery, but they're all exhausted. I'll show you real quick. So every single one of them is laying down. Fuzzy's asleep. Hershey's asleep. Ruby's asleep. Rosemary's asleep. Sarah's the only one who's not asleep. Why aren't you asleep? Why aren't you asleep, Zero? But anyways, um, sure she's up there now. So that's her nose right now. So we had another dog attack her. Um, we didn't have another dog. Another dog attacked my little Hershey. Definitely one of the worst things that could have happened. I feel so bad for her. Her nose is getting better. I think it's day seven, as I mentioned, of her nose being like that. 
So it's healing, it's just taking some time. And she really didn't like the beach very much, neither did Fuzzy. Fuzzy wanted to sleep the entire time. He uh, wanted, and wanted to stay in the car. Hershey barked at people, but didn't really care either. Rosemary and Ruby ran out into the water. Ruby actually, we got a little deeper, and Ruby said she had enough, so she took the leash and dragged me back to shore with her. So she, uh, she, she's definitely the one that likes the water the most. And then Mr. Fuzzy Britches over there, Zero, even though I said Fuzzy Britches, that's like fuzzy, but Zero actually hated the water. He absolutely hates the water. But we all had a good time. Now we're just tired and ready for a nap. Um, Chris went to get something to eat for us. For me and him and my mother-in-law, sister-in-law, and niece and nephew. So now we're just going to wait to eat. So nice out. And we all right, so we are actually back at the hotel room with the dogs. I'm making a doggy dinner time. It's a little late, but we usually feed breakfast late and feed dinner late, so they keep on a schedule. Fuzzy got, has puppy food. Hershey has a mix of puppy food and adult food. Zero has adult food. Rosemary, because she's pregnant, has puppy food. Down here in Galveston, at the Walmart, they actually don't have fresh pet. And I usually get fresh pet when we're down here, but I guess for once they didn't have fresh pet. They didn't even know what we were talking about. They looked at us like we were crazy. I think we went to the Kroger last time, but oh well. So Ruby is eating a uh, canned chicken. And the only way I can get Rosemary to eat this fresh pet is by squishing it with canned chicken. So I got all this other stuff right over here. Let's hope we don't have a problem with the uh, opening this up. I usually have a butter knife or something because I uh, have bad anxiety. Oh, I got an idea. I have bad anxiety, so uh, I bite my nails, so I don't have any nails. And so it's not really easy for me to stop biting my nails, or I gotta look them this out real quick in the sink. Hold on, and this is needed for y'all, for y'all. So I started coming prepared with the, watch out, with the water bowls. I am prepared with the, uh, oh, I forgot I gave Ruby's bowl to my mother-in-law because they didn't bring any dog bowls. So I guess I'll feed Ruby out of the can. Give Ruby a little bit more chicken than that. Um, anyways, what was I saying? No nails, because of my anxiety. I got it, Ruby, I know. Hershey, I know. They think they're getting chicken too. They have to stick to dog food. So Ruby came from a bad situation. I think I did I did an introduction video with Ruby not too long ago. And uh, when we rescued her, she's very sensitive. She has the like most sensitive stomach I have ever seen. So we we uh, stick to fresh pet because every time I end up giving her something else, it makes her sick. Oops, that might be a little bit too much for Ruby. But. And then uh, with Dot, Dot was getting old, but her teeth were bad, or starting to get bad anyways. So she went on the fresh pit because it was softer for her, so, and she loved it. I mean, she chowed down on that stuff, and she, she just loved it. Um, so we moved Ruby to it, and, um, what's I saying? We moved Ruby to it, and then we got Rosemary, and obviously Rosemary, would eat her dog food because she saw them eating it. But I haven't had any problem with these guys. They've been very good. And I try to mix Rosemary's food as best as possible so she cannot pick the chicken out. That's one thing I've seen with her dog food is that she gets in the habit of picking it out. But then my fingers get all chickeny. That's like the word, new, new, that's like a new word. But I can't believe, I forgot I gave them Ruby's bowl. They just had water and, oops. It had a water and a water spot and a food spot. I gotta go wash my hands. So I gave the bowl to them. Um, our bowl, our, uh, we 
have a travel water bowl. We have a travel water bowl. But anyways, I'll show you their uh, beast. I got a little sunburn. My arms hurt a little bit. But anyways, I'll show you their beast. Rosemary, Fuzzy, Hershey, Zero, and I think I have something for Ruby, but they're all patiently waiting for doggy dinner time, so let's not keep the uh, princes and princesses waiting too long. Good, beautiful morning, everybody. Uh, it's uh, Monday. We're heading home. Ruby's got her head out the window. Ruby and Zero and Rosemary, too. Wherever Rosemary is. Um, I got Mr. Crybaby back there. There's Rosemary. And I got a little itty bitty Hershey with me. But um, they went souvenir shopping. I was wanting to go to uh, um, a bubble tea shop, but it's starting to storm. So there is, it looks like it's about to start storming. So I guess I'll be skipping that. I might just go at the house. Next time we'll make a trip by ourselves. It's been a bit of a fun little trip been a bit much but anyways kind of sunburned so Pokemon Go's been awesome though coming down here I actually got to hold a gym for a little while that I passed and a bunch of Pokestops got a bunch of Pokemon caught a lot of Eevees that's what I've been looking for is the Eevees and that's basically been what we've been up to did a lot of catching we didn't go crab hunting I wanted to go to the pier too, Pleasure Pier, but again, yeah. So I'll be going next time. We'll be taking a trip by ourselves. So hair is messy, but it was nice. It was a nice day. The dogs had fun. Dogs are ready for a nap already. But anyways, now to make the trip home. Uh -huh. 